What's up, Kickstarter? We're really happy to see you. Oh, camera two? What's up, guys? <laughs> Sphero's mission is to inspire the freighters of tomorrow. We've been making robots for years, seven or eight years now, and we've learned a lot of cool lessons about how to make a robot and why to make a robot. Over the last eight years, we've been building robots for all sorts of different audiences. We've got tons of feedback from people, and so we finally decided we're gonna build the robot for the people, and this is that robot. Rover is our latest programmable, customizable robot, and it's our most complete, most refined, and most capable robot ever. Rover is an out-of-the-box robotic platform. It comes along with all this stuff just built in, things like driving and sensors that you can just start on immediately. But the thing that makes it special is it's super expandable. What's super unique about Rover is we put in a UART expansion port, which opens it up in a way that we've never made available before. Rover is Sphero's first platform that allows students and makers to be able to hardware hack. If you've ever messed with a Raspberry Pi or an Arduino, or a micro bit, you can put that onto Rover and make that project mobile. Rover works with our Sphero EDU app. You get the rich experience of our community and our EDU ecosystem. You don't have to assemble anything. You can start coding right away. You get a complete polished product, and then you've got the ability to expand and build it into anything you want. It's got all-terrain capabilities. We've got high torque motors with a high gear ratio, which allows it to go fast, but also allows it to go really accurate at slow speeds. If something disrupts the treads, or if one track tread moves at a different speed than the other, it'll still go in the heading that you originally intended, which is something you need for tank treaded vehicles. The driving experience is unlike anything you've ever seen before. We worked really diligently to make sure this gearbox was robust. We made sure every single gear tooth would be able to withstand mulch or rocks. We have infrared communication that you can use to talk to other robots, other rovers, or even our bolts, so they can send messages to each other, play tag. We've got an ambient light sensor inside so it can detect you know, different light values and behave differently. Rover includes a 4600 milliamp hour battery, rechargeable via USB-C. We knew this is first and foremost a tool, and you need to be able to swap out a battery and a tool. Underneath, there's a color sensor, which allows you to detect the color value that it's driving over and write programming based on what color it detects. It's got a full nine-axis IMU, so we've got gyro, accelerometer, magnetometer. This is the platform I've been waiting for. It has the accuracy, the precision, the durability, the SDK, the low latency communication. It has everything you need to actually accomplish your mission. Don't just move around, but go do something everything from the gear ratio to the clearance underneath to how you hold it, how you interact with it has been thought through. We didn't just choose the cheapest option, we chose the right option. We wanted it to have personality and be approachable and draw people in. You know, there are a lot of competitor products that are really cool bots, but you have to do a ton of work to get it up and running. Or it's super easy to get up and running, but then it doesn't do that much. The thing we're really trying to do is make something that right out of the gate you can get started, but you can kind of keep going with it for a long time. Rover is built for you guys. We want the hackers and the makers and the students out there to take it and make the coolest projects out there and help inspire us. Get, get a Rover, it's awesome. I am getting a Rover, uh, probably, probably more than one. You should also do that. Don't you want one of these? Rover, you're so beautiful. Help us get the best looking robot in the world to market. I'm hoping that people enjoy it and um, use it in all sorts of ways that I never expected. Thank you so much for checking this out, and we look forward to seeing what you guys do with Rover. <laughs>